hello there welcome to yet another video on the jira tutorial for business analyst uh, video series uh, this is episode number two um, we're going to talk about the project setup in episode one it was more of an overview and if you're a new ba or anyone getting into uh, agile methodology jira is a valuable tool and in this video series we're going to cover hands-on view of uh, how to do stuff on jira so in this episode as i stated earlier we're going to cover the project setup and uh, we're going to use this uh, the case study for a restaurant called abc cuisines they're looking for a online home delivery service so just a quick recap so we're going to load up the backlog and also the sprints for this particular uh, project so how how it actually happens in the in the projects is in case if your company already has a jira license and your and there's already a project set up then it's very simple all you have to do is just send out a request to the admin of the jira and they will get you added on to the project but that's how uh, in companies who are familiar with agile methodology uh, works but in case if uh, your company or your role is new or your company does not have any Jira setup or access then the first thing in this whole setup what you have to do is create a project in in the Jira tool so that's what we're going to look at on the on the browser so just let, let me quickly swap to that uh, Jira dashboard so in case uh, you, you know if you don't have Jira access you can add add to the, the URL, I'll put a URL in the description box. There's a seven days free trial. Uh, you can try out Jira for yourself, right? So in the Jira uh, software, this is how your dashboard would look like. So this is uh, this is a uh, test account just for demonstration purposes. If you're gonna create a, a project, so you have to come to the projects tab here in the Jira software and then click on create project. So there is classic and try and extend. I would recommend classic at this moment. And then you would uh, basically change the template to scrum because that's what um, we're gonna look at. Uh, all the principles uh, are basically aligned to scrum. So create a project, you know, put a project name. So we are, uh, we are doing this for a restaurant called ABC Cuisine. So you can just name the project as ABC Cuisine. Or ABC, anything, anything uh, uh, to make it simple, and then click on create. So what this will do is it will create a project, and this project is kind of a workspace for everything uh, related to the the development work, the agile, the backlog, the sprints. All of those will be. Uh, and you know basically uh, aligned under this particular project which is called ABC so if you see there is this uh, uh, dashboard yeah this is what you're seeing then we have the backlog there's nothing there yet but we're going to kind of uh, create out all those things no active sprint uh, nothing there nothing would be there in the reports because we haven't started so there'll be a lot of things uh, we're going to look at one by one but at, at the first uh, thing or the bare basic is the the project creation and uh, as i stated earlier if if you have, if you want to try it out uh, go to, I'll, I'll put a link for jira.com so you can, can can go and uh, sign up for a 7 day free trial uh, there's no credit card needed you can just sign up and you can just try try out jira for yourself yep so if you want to go uh, click on the projects tab here it will show all the projects which has been created by you and it will be there and you can swap in case if you're handling multiple projects but usually um, at a time a business analyst works on a single project and uh, if it's as i stated earlier if the project's already created all you have to do is send out an email to admin they will add you up if not you need to create uh, the project as we sh shown and select the scrum as a template type so that uh, it aligns to the uh, scrum agile methodology so that's that's about uh, uh, a short uh, video on this and we're going to continue the series we're going to look at different aspects of that but for this video i'll end it here short and sweet uh, just create a project and the project is your workspace uh, which will contain everything related 
uh, to that particular work piece of work which you're doing until next video see you bye bye